so we're here today to look at the Phase 1 IXM on the new P3 integration which is available on the M300 RTK. And what we'll be looking at today is just looking at the sheer uh, data quality and integrity of the imagery. Mounted onto the M300 we're looking at about getting 25 minutes flight time out of it and really now with the P3 and the IXM on the M300 makes this as, as a perfect solution for survey and inspection purposes. The perfect application for this kind of setup would be for mainly for the inspection purposes. This is 100 megapixel imagery so a large footprint which allows you to collect less images on site we'll be able to review that data later so you don't miss anything so certainly the survey industry will be an ideal uh, solution for that as well as the inspection industry these are the two main beneficiaries of utilizing a camera setup like this on an m300 rtk so if you're looking at to utilize this camera previously they'd have to go on a heavy lifting drone like the m600 pro now with this configuration with the m300 makes a seamless solution in terms of workflow and collecting data so it's fully integrated onto the DJI pilot flight planning software as well as the manual flight and you can also change all your camera settings on the screen as well which allows you to be able to capture the perfect imagery in flight. P3 integration is the uh, latest um, development from, from phase one. Uh, it's to, uh, to bring forward basically synergy in, in the technology offered by DJI with a new M300 to basically facilitate the um, installation of the IXM series camera. So it's available in either 50 or 100 megapixel with a range of lenses for either mapping or inspection. There's also a smart focus feature which is a laser rangefinder device which fully takes control of the, um, the focusing mechanism inside the lens to ensure that the customer's generating the uh, optimal image quality every uh, every frame. Generally with our camera because it's a uh, medium format sensor you can generate higher resolution imagery from a uh, much larger distance which brings forward a greater greater safety case. So it's the largest frame size available from uh, any UAV camera but also with the medium format sensor you've also got a higher dynamic range meaning that you can operate in a wider variety of lighting conditions as well as uh, increasing your efficiency from the um, from the larger frame size. Metric camera basically um, means that the camera the sensor and the lens is calibrated as a single package that means that all of the inter interior orientation parameters of the camera are fully known meaning that the uh, the TIFF generated by the phase one camera is fully distortion corrected and that means that once you've imported that into your photogrammetry software there's another step that the software doesn't have to take care of because there's no longer a requirement to do a self calibration meaning that you're you're more efficient in your, your processing workflow. Against the Zem use P1 so uh, the camera is a much bigger frame size of course so uh, you're much more efficient in data capture. The camera is also specifically built for the airborne environment. It's fully IP53 certified meaning that your investment is protected from dust ingress and from water splash and uh, yeah the uh, image quality is, is far superior to the P1 meaning that you're going to capture those critical details to help support your inspection or mapping application. Yeah, so the Phase 1 is an industrial manufactured camera. So what we offer our customers is a, a seven year minimum service and support for every Phase 1 product released, meaning that the customer can generate his return of investment on a much longer period. So all of this is going together to, uh, to really bring around the best return of investment on any, uh, any UAV platform available. It can essentially combine with the M300 as well. Customer has a 20 to 25 minute uh, flight endurance, meaning that in that period he's, he's got the ability to collect the, uh, the greater amount of data, especially when compared to traditional UAV cameras and so it's a lot uh, a lot easier to generate your return of investment with a phase one compared to any other camera on the market purely from the, the standpoint of the, the longevity of the support contract. Uh, from a standpoint it's it's the ease of use of the DJI product it's a class leading UAV product it's it's simple to use straightforward and it, it made complete sense to marry our technology with um, with leading technologies already on the market so uh, from phase one's point of view it was, it was a perfect uh, perfect match. <laughs>